hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is Rosanna so in today's video I wanted to do like a nice rosy summery makeup look so that is what we're going to be doing today but before we get into that video I would love 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 for you to subscribe to my channel you can ring the bell it will give you notifications of when I post which is every Tuesday and every Saturday so yep like make comments tell your friends subscribe help a newbie out I would so so appreciate your support and thank you so so much for helping me grow this channel and now without further ado let's get started Okay, so I had this idea because I saw Kelly Gooch the other day, although I, now I can't find the friggin' video, but she had this beautiful eye look, and I think, I think, I think she had the Charlotte Tilbury, this is the, um, the Pillow Talk, Luxury Pillow Talk Quad, I think this is what she had on, but then I was, as I was looking at her, you know, she's very pale, younger, way younger than me beautiful porcelain skin but I think she had on that and then she had like this and I don't know if it was um Charlotte Tilbury because I have a few um liners this color but I think she had on the the uh the pillow talk liner it looked something like this it's got like that kind of like maroon kind of vibe but with like that little red undertone anyway so I'm thinking that eye look looks so beautiful. Let's try to recreate it and put like a summery rosy twist to it. I have nothing on my face. And you know, now that I'm looking down, it's a lot of Charlotte Tilbury, but anywho, I digress. Nothing on my face, just a little bit of face moisturizer, but I'm gonna go in with some more face moisturizer. This is the e.l.f. Holy Hydration Face Cream because I have been incorporating the Physician's Formula. This is the Physician's Formula um, Butter Glow Bronzing Serum so nice i did a video um last week i don't know when this video is going to go up so i did a video previously about the bronzing drops what's the hype what what's all about ps they're um they're all the same but i'll leave that video linked below but i have really really been loving um these drops i really do so i'm going to just take about that much yeah 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 i'm going to take about that much on my hand maybe a little bit more because my face is super duper dry. My hands are so dry, by the way. I even had to look it up every spring. My hands get so damn dry. And like around here, like I get like these little blisters underneath my skin. Anyway, I looked it up. It's some kind of dermatitis. I don't know, but it happens every springtime. Like every spring. And then like it lasts for a couple days. And then it goes away. But then my hands are left like cracky. But anyway, whatever. Shaking the bottle. Shake the bottle. Okie doke. So I'm gonna. I don't like these droppers. I can't stand them. I think they're so darn messy. But I'm gonna put like maybe that much on. Whatever the heck that is. Mixity mix mix. I think these drops. I have to tell you the truth. They're so pretty, and they really make your skin look so nice and glowy and bronze. Look how pretty that looks. P.S. You know, Physicians Formula. I'm gonna go down the neck. They have that scent. If you don't like that scent, you know I you know how I feel about scents on my face. This is okay. This is not as bad as like their butter, like bronzer and stuff like that, because I just can't take. But look how freaking beautiful that makes your skin look, right? That is so pretty. Now out of curiosity, I'm just wondering. Can I put like a little bit of drops like like extra? I just put two right over here. Now that I have like yeah, I guess you can. Now that I have some kind of moisturizer or something on my face, I know I've seen like girls use these bronzing drops on TikTok and they just put it on their face. It is not uh, advertised as such, like on their directions. It says to put it in either a moisturizer or your foundation or your sunscreen because it looks patchy. It looks patchy, patch, patch. It needs something with it look how beautiful talk about a nice summer glow that is so nice let me just wipe my paws speaking of paws mm, you have the life bachalulu you sure do Alrighty, so i think i'm gonna just let that dry for a little bit should we do the eyes first because i really think it's gonna be the eyes that are gonna really um stand out with this rosy kind of look if you will you know what i think i'm gonna do before we do that you know, I have been loving um, to spot conceal with my Natasha Denona. This is the N3. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to just spot conceal and let it sit for a little bit. Just a tiny bit. What's up, girl? What's up with the hive? It's such a nice day out. Can you hear those birds chirping? 
I have a woodpecker that's outside my window. Not all the time. Don't you ever get tired? I mean, it could be all day. Like, didn't you break your beak? Holy shishka bibble. Okay, that's about it. Listen, other than like this little cover up here. My complexion looks pretty stinking good, right? Whatever. All right, so we'll let that sit there for a moment. So here I am. So this is the um, Charlotte Tilbury. I haven't touched this. It's got to be at least a year. This is the Pillow Talk, but this is the Luxury Palette. I know she's got a couple of the Pillow Talks. I like it because I think the original one had all shimmers in it. But look how pretty that is. Is it worth the money for four freaking uh, shadows? No, but I have it. So I grabbed that, but then, you know, for a little shimmery shim shimmer, I grabbed the Hollywood Flawless Eye Filter. I don't even know if these are still in stock, but these are all, like, shimmery. They're more of, like, a satin, because you know how I feel about shimmers on my lids. All right, so let's just go in, and I think I'm going to... These are dirty, and... Again, so what of it? This is the Angie Hot and Flashy and BK Beauty A503. I'm going to go in with this color right over here. And I'm going to put it all over my lid. That is, okay, yeah, yeah. Shh, it's so pretty. Do you guys have any plans for the summer? We're usually away for Memorial Weekend. And then I think we're going away in, sometime in July. But, you know, just keeping it close to home. As you guys know, or if you don't follow me, please do so. We lost our mom back in September. I won't say back in September, but it was last year, back in September of 23. So we still have our dad, thank God, but he just turned 90. And we're like, Dad, we're going to go to the beach because I can't remember the last time that poor man went to the beach. You know, like any loving couple he didn't want to do anything without her he wouldn't even come over dad come over i'm gonna come pick you up we're gonna um i just bought like whatever a nice dessert you want to come over for a cup of coffee and like this well, what about your mom um and your mom i said well that's okay you know she doesn't you know she really wasn't that mobile yeah no why don't you guys come over here and bring it over like he never friggin left her ever i just changed my brushes and i'm gonna go in um with the 502 with the darker color I took him to Italy. You guys know that. You know, I still have so many pictures and videos. I know it's, like, been a while now. Leave me some comments below if you still want to see it. I was just going to do, like, like just, like, a, a montage of, like, videos and pictures just with, like, music behind it. Let me know if you guys want to see that. And I'll just put it. Maybe I'll do, like, an Instagram story. I don't know. But it's just the pictures are so beautiful. And the videos are so beautiful. It makes me sad that they're just sitting there on my computer i want to darken this up a little bit so what i think i'm gonna do is did i bring anything no row don't do it don't darken it never mind let's leave it i want to just go back in with the lighter shade just to blend that in right over you know what i'll do comments below again do you do you your, is your brain a squirrel i'm like boop, 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 bow, pow pow my kids are always like mom i'm gonna just use the charlotte tilbury um bronzer just up here it's like mom out of curiosity, don't get mad. Do you think you, um, have you ever been diagnosed with ADD? Probably. Probably. But you know what? There was no diagnosis back then. That was just your personality. And who cares? Why do we have to be labeled? Probably. Probably. And what of it? What of it? Okay, so we're going to leave it like that. I'm going to go in with my finger with this color over here and then put this as a topper. I hope it comes out right. I see um, Kelly. I'll leave her um, channel down below. She's so damn cute. Look how pretty that is. Mm, that's so nice. That is so pretty. Ooh, that is so nice. I think it's going to be the liner that's going to really throw it over the edge. I'm going to just take that shimmer. The almost hard pan, but then again, you haven't used it in a long time. What do you expect? Okay, now I'm going to just tap it. Ooh, that's so pretty. I love that. Nice, 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 nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go for it. I think what I'm going to do is um, I have my regular eyeliner, the uh, Too Faced 
the Too Faced um, Killer Liner in Killer Espresso. I think I'm gonna tight line with it. Yes, this one bleeds, by the way, but all you need to do is to clean it up, or though maybe we'll leave it. Hmm, let's see. So I'm gonna just tight line real quick. Okay, so I did a little bit of tight lining, and what I think we're gonna attempt the wing, we're gonna attempt the wing, and then I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just go right above the eyelid, but stay super -de duper close to my lashes first. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I went through my liners, you saw that, and I noticed that I had a couple of these colors. Like I think I have this one, I have like the Patrick Ta. And I swore then, I'm like, girl, you need to start changing up your eyeliner. So here we are. Can you see that? That's so pretty. I'm gonna take my little, my favorite little brush to do wings. Let me clean it. This is the um, BK Beauty uh, 208. I like to just take the product off of here. But I don't know if this is gonna be like enough. We'll see. We'll see. Mm hmm. Hmm, that looks nice, right? It looks pretty. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm thinking. Hmm. Girls are always cousins and they're not sisters. Hmm. I like that. Wow, that's really pretty. I like that a lot. Who are you, girl? Wearing a different color eyeliner. Who are you? That is so pretty. Nice. Let's just go and blend out some of this face product. I'm going to just tap it out. This is the Anissa Beauty Angled Concealer Brush. I like to just tap it out before I put on my foundation, skin tint, blah, blah just to thin it out a little bit. Okay, I like these eyes. That is so nice. Exactly what I was thinking. Cousins, not sisters. Okie dokes, I'm gonna go in with, where, where did I put, oh here it is. A lighter hand girl, it's summertime. Going in with the L'Oreal True Match. I mean, can you see that? Just that much and even that's too much. Okie dokes, I'm gonna just take my sponge and just start blending. I try not to wear too much like foundation in the summertime and I have been really really enjoying like how my face looks when I just use like the concealer okay that is so nice put some on my ears since they're out so pretty that is beautiful all right I'm going to just go in with the Charlotte Tilbury this is the uh the Sunkiss Glow Bronzer which I love I haven't grabbed it in a second I, I grabbed the two medium I also have the the one but I grabbed this one I like to use like a damp sponge for like my cream products especially in the summertime I wear my hair back because it's so damn hot out sometimes very glowy very delish that is so pretty right nice i'm gonna just go over it real quick with the powder i got the charlotte tilbury um matte blush wand i love this product as you could see this is in pillow talk damn you know what i should have really did like a full face of charlotte tilbury would you like to see that? Leave me some comments. So I'm gonna just tapity tap tap. Here's another thing. As I just put like bronzer on and then I put powder and now I'm gonna put, yeah, see, now I'm gonna put like a cream. Like, it's so tricky. Like those, you have to do this. You can't do that. You can't put powder over this and then more stuff over blah, blah, blah. Like, it's kind of tricky. That is so friggin' pretty, right? And then again, as the as I'm thinking about, that's kind of tricky. Who cares, man? I'm I'm a rule bender. I always say like I always say that I'm like mm, I'm really like a rule bender, if you will. I'm not gonna break the law, 
but I will test you, man. I'm a why learner. I don't know about you guys. Like, I need to know why. And if something doesn't make sense, we're going to go head to head. I, I, I'm, not, I'm not a follower. That's beautiful. Ooh, that is so nice. Look at this beautiful glow. I'm really loving these eyes. Exactly what I was thinking. But I will be honest with you. They're kind of dry because you've had them a thousand years. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm gonna go. Um, I'm gonna go in with the house labs. You know, I have been loving this friggin' blush. It's so pretty. I'm just gonna. That's beautiful. So just a pop. Gonna go back in with my sponge. A tiny bit of concealer. The N1, Natasha, the N1, tiny bit, because, you know, throughout summertime. But, you know, you're not going to have, like, a full face of, like, makeup and then not wear concealer or vice versa, you know? And I know it's light, but here's a little tricky trick trick. Okay, so that's it. That. Whatever tool that you use that has any kind of product left over, whether it be your bronzer, whatever, just use it to blend in, and nine out of 10 times, it'll just blend right on in. So I'm gonna just take my, look at that, how pretty. Mm-hmm. All right, that's cool. I have this Benefit Dandelion Twinkle highlighter that I have. I don't think I've ever used it. Look how beautiful it is. I thought it would be so sweet and delicate. Look how pretty. Ooh, look how pretty that is. Can you see that? I thought it would be really, really nice to use, whoops, to use on this summer. Look up, wow, look up pretty. Ooh, that is so pretty. That is so, so nice. I think I'm going to use this for my inner corner. Yeah, that's so pretty, right? Okie dokes. Look, I'm looking through this mirror. It still has the plastic on it. It's so warped. I'm like, I gotta clean this. No, girl, because you haven't even taken the plastic off yet. Okay, cool. Let's finish the eyes. I'm gonna do my brows. I just have the um, the NYX Professional Makeup Micro Brow in Brunette. That is so, so nice. So, so nice. Let's just put on some lip smacking. And I'm going, what I think I'm going to do is, let me just wipe some off. I have the, my usual girl, the City Lips Lip Plumbing Glossing Clear. You know there's always an affiliate link below. You guys get 15% off. And if you ever use my affiliate links in, in all the description below, of course, that helps me um, with my channel. And I really appreciate it. But... I'm going in with the NYX um, a lip liner, and this is a nude suede shoes because I really think like this rosy kind of look is all about the eyes, right? Aren't they so pretty? Ooh. Anyway, so I'm going to go in with the nude. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah. Mm hmm That's pretty. I think I'm going to fill in my whole lips or most of them. What did I bring as lip smacking? Oh, okay, yeah. That is so friggin' pretty. This is a could be a little bit too light. Let's see. Let me just see. I have the um the Christian Audette and Tara Lynn lip smacking gloss. This is in Ray. I'm not really sure if they still have it. I think they do. If they don't, any like opaque lip gloss will do. Yeah, that's pretty. Does it match? A little bit, right? Hmm, I think so. That's really pretty. I haven't grabbed it in a long time. I hope it's still there. I hate using products that you can't get anymore, but there's no but. I hate using products you can't get anymore. Wow, that's so nice. All right, so let me just assess. Of course, I need a little bit more blush because I'm a blushy girl. Yeah, 
So I don't smile. I just put it on the apples. I am so delicious and glowy and fabulous. Hence the whole point of the video, a nice rosy glowy summery look. But if you guys, if it's too shiny for you guys, just mat it out with a little bit of powder um, where you see fit. P.S. I just did look up this lip gloss. It is still there. It is on Christian Audette's website. Of course, I'll leave it below. But anyway, so I think that's it. Ooh! I love it. I love it, love it, love it. I will tell you this, full disclosure, confession. These are beautiful, but they are dried out because I did have a hard time. Like, it was skipping a little bit, especially, like, in the wingity wing wing because, you know, I know I'm a professional winger. But it skipped a little bit, but the color is so beautiful exactly what i was looking for so anyway guys so this is it this is my final look on my rosy glowy summer look what do you guys think i think it came out so damn pretty it's these eyes it's these eyes but anyway so that is it this is my video thank you so so much for sharing your time with me and as always you guys be good to each other love each other and have a great great day bye